Welcome back to Flora and the Novice Explorers. You join us on day 28. We've had a slight hiatus, but we are back and raring to go. You may notice our friend here, the Hapro Rodi 4000. This video has been made possible by Hapro and the guys at roofbox.co.uk. Link in the description if you want to check out their website. We use roofbox.co.uk a lot during our search for our roof box. We knew that we needed something fairly square in size as we're battling for space with the solar panel and the Hatbro Rodi 4000 fit the bill perfectly. So this video has been on the go for the past couple of weeks. So here's the footage of us taking off our roof rack to make some amendments. One of the first amendments we did was to remove this. This is the roller bar that was sitting at the back of the roof rack. We just undid the bolts and have no need for it. So this will be going... In the scrap pile? <laughs> <laughs> Recycled to something, yeah. Yeah, the purpose of the roller bar is really more for trades people. Uh, with their ladders, which we are not trades people and we only use a ladder every other time. <laughs> <That you> <laughs> The second and more permanent amendment we made to the roof rack was to hacksaw out one of the bars. Now this might sound a little bit dramatic, uh, but it had to be done to make this a perfect fit. The bar wasn't structural or integral to the roof rack, so we didn't mind too much. So now today we are fitting the son of a gun. We've been looking forward to fitting this for a while and it has a, a very handy 400 litre capacity, which means that we can take some of our less important items out of the van and free up some much needed space. Now it's time to lift the roof box onto the roof rack. We've got the roof box now in the vague position that we want it. We've got it pretty centralised just so we've got good access and we're able to fit the key in nice and easy. Now we're just going to put it exactly into the position we want it and lock it down in place with the little screw fixings. The screw fixings that they've supplied are really easy to use and fit pretty much any roof rack or roof bars that you've got on your car slash van already. Now it is time to fix the roof box in position. It's pretty straightforward, all we have to do is push through these little clasps, twist them tight, lock them in place, make sure they're nice and sturdy. This is a very simple pincer and movement. I'll show you here. You've got your clasps underneath and they'll go around the bar like that. And as you twist on top, they just move closer and closer and closer around the bar. Once they're nice and sturdy, click that in place and you've got a nice solid fit. So no tools required, nice and easy. You can move it about and take a lot of measure, please. <laughs> We've got four of these in total. So two at the front, two at the back, and they'll anchor it down to the roof rack nice and safely. Once again, a massive thank you to the guys at Hatpro and Roofbox.co.uk for making this video possible. Uh, we're really excited to get using that roof box and it's going to come in so handy. Thank you very much for watching and we're off on another adventure. Woo! Remember to follow us on our social medias. We've got Instagram, Twitter and obviously here on YouTube. 